Hello, I'm Dan Robinson, Operational Manager here at Fayetteville Public Television. Welcome to the first quarter 2021 FPTV Service Providers Report. Fayetteville Public Television is a resource here in Fayetteville that offers classes in video production, resources to produce video, and a channel on Cox 218, ATTU Verse 99, Ozarks Go 44, and on YouTube Live to share your videos with a television and internet audience. We had an exciting start to 2021 thanks to our strong community partnerships. We've continued actively serving students, organizations, and city departments in spite of the television center being closed to the public. Our educational numbers are back to where they were pre-pandemic. We've seen consistent gear traffic and programs being submitted by the community. Let's start with a look at our educational activity. In the first quarter of 2021, we had 61 class participants result in 142 class participations. It's amazing to see our educational numbers back to where they were pre-pandemic. This was largely due to our partnership with CEN, a Fayetteville-based homeschooling organization. Our Director of Education, Paola Blanco, designed and taught an eight-week class on video production for their film production class. The students used FPTV equipment to produce their projects. We are also seeing great success with our new content creation class. We've found that this overview has already made a big difference for our students when it comes to planning their productions. This class lays effective groundwork for any video production project. We have created a brand new studio lighting class that is specific to our new studio lighting system. This new system is all DMX controllable LED instruments, which allow us to light the studio like never before. We are excited to see what the community will do with this resource, and we are happy to have more efficient and versatile lighting in the studio. Beginning in April, the Television Center will be open to the public by appointment. We are excited to begin in-person classes, studio production, and offering the edit bays for use. We will be offering hybrid classes in our classroom that allow students to attend virtually or in person. All of our class materials are available online in both English and Spanish. We are excited to be able to offer our class materials to a wider part of our community. Let's take a look at production activity. The first quarter was active with productions, including Later with Jason Sewell, Open Mic, and external community productions. We also produced a pilot for a new bilingual show, What's Up Que Pasa, featuring local celebrity Al Lopez. Let's take a look at equipment use. In the first quarter of 2021, we still weren't able to offer the Television Center as a resource to the public, but what we were able to offer stayed high in demand. The notable increase was in editing laptop checkouts. Thanks to the support of the city, we were able to get three new laptops to offer for checkout. They have been very busy as editing resources are high in demand. Let's take a look at programming. We continue to see active production submission from the community for the channel. The programming we have running on the channel represents 197 program requesters in the first quarter of 2021. We have had robust outside programming submissions due to the pandemic. If there is a video you would like to share with the community, feel free to visit our website at faypublic.tv where you can find our online program submission form. Let's take a look at our promotional and outreach activity. We had an active and exciting first quarter with promotional activity. Our social media campaigns on Facebook and Instagram keep people up to date with the things happening at the Television Center. I had an opportunity to be a guest host on Good Day NWA on Fox 24, which gave me a wonderful opportunity to share with the audience about FPTV and its resources. I also had the pleasure of being a guest presenter at the Artful Arts Integration Seminar presented by the University of Arkansas. There, I had the opportunity to share with current and future teachers about ways to integrate video into their curricula. Community engagement opportunities like these are one of my favorite ways to share with people about the resources available at FPTV. In conclusion, the first quarter of 2021 was an exciting and promising start to the year. We are thrilled to welcome people back to the Television Center in April and that we are already seeing production momentum growing quickly. We are proud to continue to offer access to video education and resources without the obstacles of cost or censorship. 
Your Media, the contract service provider, is always seeking new ways to serve the community and the region with this valuable resource. We encourage you to visit our website at faypublic.tv. You can like us on Facebook or on Instagram. You can subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay up to date on the latest content being produced. You can give us a call at 479-444-3433 with any questions. Thank you for your attention and for your support. We look forward to helping you make your video ideas a reality.